Good morning from the corner of Upworth and Lincoln. I'm Pastor Danny. Uh, it is a little bit overcast uh, morning this morning or foggy, uh, whatever, whatever it is. A little bit darker today in the chapel as we get kicked off of this Friday. We're talking about Ezekiel, working through this scripture, Ezekiel, where uh, a field has been fallow for a long period of time. And, and God is planting and, and, and bringing back uh, 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 crops to that field. God's doing the work. And so today we're going to continue in that vein, talking about how uh, our field, the acreage, the, the, the property that God has blessed us with to do his work in, how are we doing with that? How are, are we being good stewards of the land and what is God up to on his corner of Epworth and Lincoln? And so today we're going to talk about child care. We're going to talk about finance a little bit. Uh, in our child care program, uh, we've been uh, up and running for uh, about three years or so now, and it's, it's really coming into its own. Mandy Warner has done a great job uh, of, of running the child care, getting, getting the people in, right people in place, uh, taking care of the parents, getting our Brightwell program uh, up and running, another IT thing that I didn't mention yesterday. But at the end of the day, we've got 37 children down there who have over 70 parents involved, who have additional grandparents, relatives, aunts, uncles that are touched by this child care ministry. That ministry has grown into the single largest ministry in this church. It's touching more people on a daily basis. Not only for today, not only with the updates that come out of our Bright Wheel program to tell parents whether there was a diaper change or what they had for lunch. Beyond that, it's also shaping 37 children to prepare them to get into kindergarten and to move about their lives in a way that they'll know that they have been loved and cared for. It's a vital ministry of the church. So it's doing some great things down there. <clears throat> How's it doing financially? The church had initially uh, put some seed money into the child care to get it started. They're starting to pay that money back uh, to the church from our reserve fund. Uh, they are paying uh, for some of the utilities here at the church and, and are really doing a great job. How's the church doing financially? Well, I'm going to put it this way. But the guidance of Tim Ferguson keeping us focused on the main thing, and Tim reminds me of this all the time, we're doing better than we've ever done in a long time, but we're still not as good as we should be. And so that's where, we, that's where we're at today. <clears throat> we still have a large facility that needs maintenance items. It need, we need to have an emergency fund. We need to have that rainy day fund so that, you know, <clears throat> if an air conditioner goes out tomorrow, we might have that covered. If we have a roof problem that's not covered by insurance, we probably can't handle that. <clears throat> the roof has been uh, on the child care wing as an example. It's been there for 20 years and it's starting to show signs of age. And so that's not going to be something that's going to be covered by insurance. And so we're going to have to have to be prepared to be able to take care of that. And so when, when we're not as good as we should be, there are still things left to do, and Tim is doing an excellent job of trying to make sure that we're in a position that when that happens, we're not scrambling, we're not saying that the sky's falling, we're in a position to continue to be good stewards of the facility and providing ministries, being a base of operations for ministries to be launched from touching people, reaching people, and doing what God has called us to do here. And so uh, continue to support Tim in that, uh, how do you support Tim? Continue your tithes, your offerings, gifts. Uh, continue to do that. Uh, we're not, it's, it's not time to, you know, back off the gas pedal a little bit. Uh, we've had some adjustments we've had to make as a result of COVID-19. Uh, and, and I don't know what uh, the church might look like a year from now. But it's important that we continue to give back to God a portion of what he's blessed us with. So that's the update on child care and finance today. I'm hoping that you have a blessed day. I'm hoping you're, you're encouraged by this uh, and that, uh, you know, we get a flavor for, for what's happening in the church. So today, be blessed, be encouraged, and have a great day. Amen.